Hello everyone. In this video, we will solve this interesting math question. This question is square root 3 plus 1 and whole to the power 10 is equal to what? How to solve this question? How to evaluate this radical math question? This question is square root 3 plus 1 and whole to the power 10. It is interesting math. Yes. So, solution. Okay. Our equation square root 3 plus 1 and whole to the power 10. Yes. But first of all, we'll let, let x is equal to square root 3 plus 1. Yes. But if you take this value in this case, it will be x to the power 10 is equal to what? So we are looking for x to the power 10 is equal to what? Yes. So we we'll let here is x is equal to square root 3 plus 1 yes now if i move on this one it is left side it will be negative so x minus 1 is equal to square root 3 then i use both side half square yes then we know that a minus v whole square will be x squared minus 2ab plus v squared According to this identity, I can say that this equation becomes x squared minus twice x plus 1 is equal to 3. Square root is cancelled, where find out here is 3. Then I can say that this equation becomes x squared minus twice x is equal to 2. Yes, 3 minus 1, it will be 2. Then we'll find out here is x squared is equal to twice x plus 2 yes this is our first equation we find out x squared is equal to twice x plus 2 because of that if i move on this negative 2x in this side it will be positive twice x yes then i use both side whole square again so it will be x squared is equal to twice x plus 2 I use both side whole square again. Okay. Then we know that it will be x to the power 4. Look, 2 times 2, it will be x to the power 4. And again, I use e plus v whole square formula. According to this identity, we know that it will be a square plus 2b plus b square. According to this rule, it will be 2x whole square plus 2 times twice x times 2 plus 2 square yes then this expression here is x to the power 4 and it will be 4 x square plus 2 times 2 it will be 4 4 times 2 it will be 8 x plus 4 2 to the power 2 it will be 4 then I can say that this exponential equation it will be x to the power 4 4 times but remember that x squared will be twice x plus 2 so i put on this value in this equation it will be twice x plus 2 and here is 8x plus 4 yes then i can see that this equation it will be x to the power 4 is equal to 8x 2 times 4 it will be 8x plus 8 2 times 2 it will be 4 times 2 it will be 8 plus 8x plus 4 yes now we'll find out here is x to the power 4 is equal to 16x plus 12 8x plus 8x it will be 16x 8 plus 4 it will be 12 but remember remember that we are looking for x to the power 10 is equal to what but we'll find out x to the power 4 is equal to something but we need x to the power 10 is equal to what so again i multiply uh, or i use both set whole square then i can say here is power is 2 then here is power is 2 yes i use both set whole square then 2 times 4 it will be 8 so we are find out x to the power 8 is equal to a plus v whole square will be x square plus v square plus 2ab according to this identity i can see the little bit 16 x whole square 
plus 2 times 16x times 12 plus 12 squared yes now in this expression I can easily here is x to the power 8 is equal to 16x square I can say that 16x square will be uh, 256 x square plus 2 times 16 times 12 it will be 384 x plus 144 12 square it will be 144 yes now in this expression I can say here is x to the power 8 is equal to 256 but remember that recall our first equation it will be x squared is equal to twice x plus 2 so I can see it will be twice x plus 2 plus 384 times x plus 144 yes I just put this value in this equation then I can see that it will be x to the power 8 is equal to 2 times 256 it will be 512 times x plus it will be 512 plus 384 x plus 144 yes now in this expression i can say here is x to the power 8 is equal to 512 x plus 384 x it will be 896 x yes and 512 plus 144 uh, it will be 656 yes 6 5 1 plus 5 it will be 6 yes so we'll find out x to the power 8 is equal to 896x and here is 500 656 yes but we are looking for x to the power 10 is equal to 1 but here is x to the power 8 so i multiply both sides by x squared so it will be x to the power 8 times x squared is equal to 896 x plus 656 times x squared look i multiply both sides x squared it is interesting yes so at this moment, we know that according to exponential rules, here is base is same, so I can easily add this exponent. So this exponent, it will be x to the power 8 plus 2. We are looking for x to the power 10 is equal to what? So 8 plus 2, it will be 10. Yes, we are find out slowly our final answer, our golden ratio. So it will be 896x plus 656. And x square recall x square will be twice x plus to our first equation now in this expression x to the power 10 it will be look 896 x and 656 i can say here is 16 is common so it will be 56 x plus this divide 16 it will be 41 and we'll find out here is 2 is common so it will be x plus 1 yes here is 2 is common so it will be x plus 1 then i can say here is x to the power 10 it will be 32 16 times 2 it will be 32 and we'll find out here is 56 x plus 41 times x plus 1 yes now this expression it will be x to the power 10 and here is 32 and this plus this it will be 56 x squared plus this divide this it will be 56 x plus this divide this it will be 41 x plus this divide sorry this multiply this it will be 41 yes this time this it will be this, this time this it will be this this time this it will be this this times this it will be this okay now in this expression I can say here is x to the power 10 is equal to 32 and we'll find out here is 56 x square plus this plus this it will be 7 and 4 plus 5 it will be 9 and here is x plus 41 we'll find out here it is x to the power 10 and here is 32 and look recall 
56 and then our first equation x squared is equal to twice x plus 2 and here is sorry here is first packet and here is 97 x plus 41 then I can say this equation x to the power 10 is equal to 32 and this time this 56 times 2x it will be 100 look um, uh, 32 and this times this it will be I can say it will be 112 yes 112 x plus 112 plus 97 x plus 40 and yes now this expression here is x to the power 10 is equal to 32 and this plus this it will be 209 x plus and this plus this it will be 153 then we are find out x to the power 10 is equal to 32 and recall here is 209 times x x is equal to square root 3 plus 1 or question x is equal to well let x is equal to square root 3 plus 1 first of all and here is plus 153 then I can say here is x to the power 10 is equal to 32 it will be 209 square root 3 plus 209 plus 153 and this expression I can easily it will be 32 times look this plus this uh, it will be I can easily uh, 209 and square root 3 and this plus this will be 362 Yes, this plus this it will be 362 this plus this it will be 362 and this value this is the value of x to the power 10 this is the final answer in this math Olympiad question thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care